Hey everyone, it's Renee, and as you can see in my title, today I'm going to be making the weirdest cotton candy flavors that I could find, and then I'm going to let you guys know whether it's a pass or a trash. Before we get started, make sure to subscribe so you can see new weird videos like this one every week. Also, make sure to hit that notification bell so you can be informed right when a new video is posted. So here is my cotton candy machine. So this cotton candy machine can turn any hard candy powder sugar or regular sugar into cotton candy. So the first cotton candy flavor that I'm going to try is this Jolly Rancher Cinnamon Fire. I don't know, I'm super curious to see if this is going to be like too spicy for me. machine gets hot. Okay, time for the first taste test. Cinnamon Fire Jolly Ranchers. This one is pretty good. It's not as hot as I thought it was going to be. It has like the cinnamon fire flavor, but it's really not that strong. Now let's compare it to the actual candy. I really thought these ones were going to be a lot spicier, but I actually really like that flavor. And the second cotton candy flavor that I'm going to try is this caramel coffee. I can do like regular coffee, but when it comes to like coffee flavor, I'm usually not a fan. And if I do drink coffee, the only reason is because I want the caffeine. Now for the taste test of the caramel coffee. It doesn't really smell like coffee, it kind of just smells like caramel. And I don't really like this flavor. Ooh, no. Well, mm. You know, this kind of tastes like Cracker Jacks, you know, the caramel covered popcorn, which again, I'm not really a fan of. So if you're a fan of caramel coffee, you'd probably like this. The flavor on this one is just really strong. So I think this one is going to be one of the nastiest flavors. So the flavor is Hall's Cough Drop. So the only reason why I would ever eat these is if I actually had a sore throat. So I'm definitely not a fan of the Cough Drop flavor. Let me know in the comments section if you guys like cough drops. Okay, I'm really scared for this one. Although, I do feel like this would be a really fun way to eat your cough drop when you are sick. Here we go. Wow. You know, this really isn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. You know, I actually admit, I kind of like the cotton candy version better than I like the regular cough drop version. It has like a really strong like cough drop flavor, but it's like super light and airy, and I actually kind of like it. The next cotton candy flavor that I'm going to try is Warheads. So I definitely had to do this one. I am a huge wimp when it comes to sour candies. I can barely eat one of these just plain. Okay, the Warheads flavor did not spin very well. And I also just kind of like mixed all of the flavors together. It is kind of cool looking. The inside is like blue and purple and then the outside is green. Oh my god, this is weird. It's not even like... It's almost like sticky. This is really good. Like it's really sour, but it's not like overwhelmingly sour. You know what? I gotta say, I think this one is definitely my favorite so far. Turning the Warheads into cotton candy kind of like reduces the sourness. This one tastes 
so much better in the cotton candy version. So, so far, all of these are not as like bad as I thought they were going to be. So the next cotton candy flavor that I'm going to try is root beer. So I actually like root beer flavor, but I thought it would be weird in like a cotton candy flavor. <laughs> Okay, now it's time to taste the root beer. This one smells so good. Oh yeah. If you like root beer, you would definitely like root beer cotton candy. The next cotton candy flavor is lemon drops. I've never actually had one of these before, but I think it's going to be sour. <laughs> Okay, now for the lemon drop. And this one has like no smell at all. I literally cannot smell anything. You know, it's not really sour like I thought it was going to be. And I think besides the coffee flavored one, I think this is probably one of my least favorite ones. And the last cotton candy flavor I think is going to be my favorite, which is Fun Dip. So I actually really like these, so I think it's going to turn out pretty good. Okay, it's a good thing that I saved the fun dip for the last because I think I broke my cotton candy machine. So the fun dip did not spin at all. I also tried to spin like the white stick that was in the package and that didn't work either. So this one was a complete fail, which I'm super sad about because I was really excited for this flavor. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching me taste all of these crazy cotton candy flavors. Let me know in the comments section which flavor you think would have been your favorite. Also, let me know which one was the weirdest. If you have any other like weird cotton candy flavors that you think I should try, let me know in the comments section and maybe I'll make a part two. So thank you all for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!